Imagine a less cluttered world, less garbage, a cleaner environment, fewer rodents and insects around our restaurants and food processing plants. Now imagine one machine that can make this all a reality. Our garbage pickup costs, everything kept going up and trying to see how do you, how do you control this? How, do you, how can we control the cost of this? Uh, we usually receive a, uh, a garbage pickup every two days and to sit out there for two days, especially in the heat of the summertime, it's not a good thing. Using the bio machine uh, has enabled us to reduce the size of our dumpster and discard less of our uh, food waste, thus uh, putting less into the landfills or sending it to treatment plants. Much of our food waste we find uh, that we can just put into the bio machine each evening and by the time we come in the next day, it's gone. Utilizing microorganisms, we are able to reduce and convert biodegradable products into a liquid that is safe for our sewer and cesspool systems. It's the most revolutionary and environmentally green solution to reducing the amount of garbage and waste in the world. With the BioX2, organic wastes are broken down through a biological decomposition process by natural microorganisms. The environmentally friendly natural microorganisms decompose solid organic wastes into harmless and odorless liquids safely and naturally. This hassle-free system significantly reduces the cost of waste disposal and carting costs. Our stainless steel units are designed to complement top-notch industrial kitchen equipment and can be installed inside the kitchen work area where organic waste is created, improving the sanitation environment and the overall workflow. Well, we're a wholesale bakery, bread bakery, but we have, as you can see, a retail store serving the area because we are a neighborhood bakery. And you know, what we're putting in the machine is whatever we have here, at the end of the day, anything that we deem stale, not fresh, we put in there. We've been able to alleviate a lot of our problems outside as far as any kind of vermin or rodents, even flies, because as we find we have stuff to put in the machine, you feed the machine constantly. It's not like you just leave it uh, and it stays there till the next day. You can feed the machine every couple of hours, every four hours, or even more, depending on the amount of waste that you have. In our particular instance, we're able to feed it all day long and not have anything laying around. So it works very well for us in that way. Well, here at Russo's, we do about uh, roughly 20 to 25 parties per week on normal uh, season. We're always looking for new, uh, new ways to save. Uh, the machine made sense to eat the garbage instead of disposing of it. So you save on your tonnage in your compactor and you can turn it into water. So it, it made sense to go that way to save money on uh, what we're disposing and basically to start to be more environmentally friendly. Well, it has benefited Kifu in a way because it reduces the, uh, the waste uh, outside the store. I don't have to load up the uh, dumpsters, you know, with all that kind of stuff. When you put it outside, you have a lot of bugs, you have all kinds of things. And then from there, they go into the store, a lot of flies. It prevents the flies from going into our store and, and everything else, you know. So the main thing is sanitary, it's more sanitary conditions. Right. What we feel like we're doing for the environment is the, uh, the advantage, what we feel like it's doing for the business. It's, it's, it's making us more responsible vendors. And nowadays, uh, everybody, are, you know, what kind of footprint are you leaving? And the green, are you green? So there's a lot there. And, uh, and the next printing on our, our menu, we have every intention of mentioning it on our menu just for the public's perception of what we're doing to help the environment. It's such an interesting concept. It's something we thought, wow, this is something we really have to look into further, uh, look into it. And, uh, and it didn't take us much, much longer than beyond the decision making after that to, to, to just to do it and, and put it in. But the simplicity of it and just the way that it, it, it operates with, with, the, with the enzyme and, and how it just basically, it eats the, it eats the garbage. Uh, you know, I just, it, that certainly is, is just the, the, the way of the future. It will eat up however many pounds the size unit is, 400, 800, 1500 pounds of food matter. Now that's immediately that would, should raise any restaurateur's attention because a lot of money is spent in waste removal. And right away, you're talking about bottom line. So 
It's one thing for the environmentally friendly people that are trying to be green and make an effort to do this, but it also is a great advantage for people that have no concern with being green, just are concerned with the bottom line. Our savings has been roughly two to two and a half tons per week of uh, saving of the garbage. Our weekly savings in refuse is approximately uh, $500 a week. We did reduce the size of our dumpster, thus, because uh, we're putting less into the dumpster each night. The uh, wet trash dumpster has reduced from a six yard to a three yard. So um, it's probably a good 60% savings by the, at the end of the year. We're very happy with the results. Um, and we couldn't, you know, we're going to continue with it.